Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are allegedly returning $9 million worth of wedding gifts. The newly married Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have had to return a bulk of the wedding gifts they've received since tying the knot. They are reportedly sending back around $9 million worth of packaged goodies that inundated their Kensington Palace home and the reason boils down to yet more royal protocol. According to official royal guidelines, the fundamental principle governing the acceptance of gifts by members of the royal family is that no gifts, including hospitality or services, should be accepted which would, or might appear to, place the member of the royal family under any obligation to the donor. That means, gifts from individuals not known personally should be refused where there are concerns about the propriety or motives of the donor or the gift itself. Bags of love, for instance will be receiving a return package from the Lovebirds. The personalized merch retailer reportedly sent the newlyweds a matching bikini and swim shorts set in the hopes they would wear the coordinating pieces on their honeymoon. Prior to their wedding a few weeks ago, the couple asked 12 wishers to donate to one, or more, of seven personally selected charities in place of gifts. While the pair have no formal relationships with the charities listed, it's clear they opted for organizations that resonate with them. The couple chose philanthropies concerned with sport for social change, women's empowerment, conservation, the environment, homelessness, HIV, and the armed forces. Prince Harry and Ms. Meghan Markle are incredibly grateful for the goodwill they have received since their engagement and have asked that anyone who might wish to mark the occasion of their wedding considers giving to charity, instead of sending a gift, the palace said in a tweet preceding the wedding. Harry chose to include the Children's HIV Association, melding with his mission to continue his mother, Princess Diana's, incredible efforts to raise awareness about HIV and AIDS. Meghan, meanwhile, picked the Mina Mahila Foundation after visiting the organization on a recent trip to India. In terms of those guests from whom they could accept gifts, the couple had put together a private gift list with Soho House. According to the Sunday Times, the top secret registry included a range of items from bath and shower gel valued at just around $30 to a cozy emperor bed worth a cool $3,761. This post was written by Candace Mata Coljack. It originally appeared on our sister site, Now to Love. Can't get enough of these two? Join our Facebook group for the latest updates on Kate Middleton, Prince William, and all things royal.